Talking about veins um, from tournament to hunting, I use Q2I veins. And um, for hunting and most of my tournaments, I use the Raptor series vein, which is like a two inch, pretty high profile and pretty stiff. Um, all the tournaments I shoot that's 50 yards and under, this is the vein you're gonna see me use. Um, it has a lot of control, really stiff. I can put a heavy point um, and not have that parachuting effect at under 50 yards. Um, which, and I can put a pretty good helical on it. Um, just all around great profile, um, which is probably my, the most intriguing thing to me about this vein is the profile and the control that that profile creates when it's cutting through the wind. Um, when I shoot anything long distance or I'm having to shoot really small arrows, I go to the Fusion, the 2.1 Fusion, which has that shield cut on the back, which is for cutting through wind or shooting in the wind. Um, and the problem with shooting long distances with a vein like the Raptor is it's feasible, but what happens is when you get too much control past 50 yards, the veins start to slow the arrow down. And what happens is when the veins are slowing the arrow down faster than what the point is wanting to do, you get a parachuting effect. Once it'll fly good till about 50 yards, then it'll start trying to slow down too fast if you have too much vein. So that's why I switched to a shield cut vein, a little bit smaller profile, but it's also a little longer. Uh, cuts through the wind a little better. I put a heavy point and it flies like a dart as far as you want to shoot these things. So in tournaments like Redding, um, I'll use this vein, um, but for hunting and, and most of my 3D stuff, um, I shoot the, the Raptor. Um, and like I said, you can get the Raptor to shoot great at 100 yards. It's just, you got to play around a lot with point weight, a lot with the diameter of the shaft, how it all affects each other cutting through the wind. Because on my hunting arrows, I shoot Raptor and I shoot great groups at 100 yards. But in tournaments, we're talking about groups like this, and in hunting, we're talking about groups like this. Um, and that's really the only difference. I mean, I'm not talking about it's going to make you shoot groups this big at 100. I'm talking about shooting groups from this to this. And, and that makes a huge difference in the tournament world. And that's why you see me use a different vein.